Hello and welcome back guys. It's been long since I made a YouTube video because I was doing some cool work but now I'm back and I realized that we have like lots of commands and lots of cool functions but we never made a help command so if someone will try to use our thing they will get stuck. So let's make a command real quick. So guys now we have our basic command. So what they're going to do is they're going to send a message with, with some basic information and a select menu. So let's begin real quick. Alright so guys our message components contains rows of these thingies. So here we are, let's do this thing. Const row is equals to new message action row. We are creating a new row. And now what we have to do is set a component. Row dot add components. And this will have a type. Type will be a select menu, of course. What else it will be? And custom ID will be select. And the placeholder, it is like the text message which you see on that thing. It will be choose a category. So it is like, well, you know, we are just saying them to choose a category. And now comes the options. How the hell we are supposed to make the options? Don't worry, I've got you. So we are going to make an empty array. And now what we will do is, I think you guys remember, we have this thingy. Client.categories is equals to this. And by the way, please add this line, command.category is equals to client.categories bracket line number 36 in index.js file. It is really important. So now what we are going to do is, we are going to make some options. You know what I'm saying? I will do it simply. I will instead of this i will do client dot categories dot map value is equals to and then we are going to return an object which will have two properties first of all label it will be equals to something i will let you know and then the value it will be equals to this field and now what we are going to do is we are going to pass v oh, wait a second dollar v dot replace we're gonna replace this something so what we are going to do is we are just making the first character uppercase that's all we are doing well we can do something like this as well let me show you both works fine and yeah that's it so guys now our options are ready and now these options are added here as well because the property name and the uh, variable name is same now let's send our message real quick so i will do const message is equals to away interaction dot reply and then this function and the values so first of all we are going to do fetch reply as true and then comes few things we will need to pass the components it will be an array which contains row and now comes a cool and bad i will tell you what we are going to do here so first of all we will have a simple title it is just client dot user dot user name help menu simple as that and we can just add a emoji right here like all right guys now the description thing is literally just depends on you it is a custom thing i already have a description let me just show you wait a second let me just copy it and paste the thing real quick so it is just a simple message which i'm going to send to the user you can make it anything custom or you can make it different as well but that's it that's all we have to do now after sending the message we have to start a collector well to be honest we can make a function in utility but i'm gonna do this because right now i'm in hurry but i'm really sorry about that guys and i'm also sorry for not uploading a video but let's just do this thing real quick so we have to create a message component collector and then we have to provide some options first of all we will provide the filter and i will tell you what the hell is this just give me a second so we are, in our filter we are going to get this interaction and we will do interaction dot user dot id should be equals to interaction dot user dot id i mean the first one is i and the second one is interaction so we are just creating a com uh, filter sorry a component collector on our message and time will be 10 thousand milliseconds that is just 10 seconds and i think they are enough and by the way we are going to need another thing so let me just create a variable called con uh, let used is equals to true it is sorry it is equals to false by default it is for checking whether our thing is used or not so i will do collector dot on collect and then we will we will get this interaction and now what we are going to do is well let's just make it async because we will need to use await inside so first of all whenever we are going to collect we are just going to do use is equals to true and now we are going to do this we are going to fetch the category like for example if someone chooses a value in our select menu to get that value we will do i dot values bracket zero all right now this is our category name and this is the value all right this one let me show you this value so it will be in lowercase of course i mean let's go and then comes another thing let's make it let for now because 
to be honest it don't really matters that much i mean it do uh, do matters a bit but and then we will do index is equals to zero because we are going to need it and i already made this thing so of course i know what we are going to need and what we do not need so first of all we will do row dot components bracket zero the first one and then we are going to change its option to this thing and this will be we are going to get all the commands of our client and then we will do filter value is equals to value dot category is equals to this category all right and then we are gonna map through these things and let me just do this real quick so what we and by the way if you don't know about basics of javascript go learn it dude. what are you waiting for if you don't know the basics of javascript you won't be able to understand what i'm doing right here but of course if you are just a copy paste nerd, then we can't really help it it's fine who cares who nobody cares about you bro emotional damn it but anyways so what we're doing here is value is equals to the name uh wait a second uh let's just rename it to c and now a value is equals to this name and then we are returning the label and the value so we have changed our options that's all we had to do now we are also going to do this components dot placeholder and instead this time we will say choose a command that's what we have to do and now we i mean like we have to do a bit more stuff so we will do uh let me think we can just do const message or maybe we can just do message is equals to so now i'm going to start uh, another collector but if you want we can do something like uh, we can just make a variable for checking like for example let x is equals to zero if x is zero then we are gonna do this thingy if x is more than zero then we are gonna do this uh, uh, the other thingy but i am not gonna do that i will just do await i dot update and i know this code is a bit shitty but it works and i will make a better one later on so guys i copy pasted some stuff the title is this we are going to make that category name look good and then we are going to say commands list and the description is something you will love to see so we are going to do client.commands.filter and then the filter is that category name is equal to that and then we are just mapping this so this plus plus index thing is for getting the number of that command like if it is the command number one two three and then we are showing the name and then the description that's all we are doing and this thing looks good according to me at least and now we are going to start and now that's it so as you can see that our collector thing is done and now we can just end our collector i will just do collector dot stop terminate so let me add just let me just add some comments and then i will do collector dot on end and do this and then we are gonna do if reason is to time and it is not used you know the thing is not used then we're gonna do this we're just gonna edit the message and components will be this stuff like that simple stuff not much of a big deal no but so you can see our category thing is done if a person chooses a category they get all the command of that category now we have to make another thing so you see that we added options for each and every command now we have to make it that if a user chooses a command they are able to you know to stuff with it like get the information on that command and stuff like that so let's start by making another collector on that same thingy and then we have to provide few thingies the filter and the time it is literally the same one i mean the values are literally same as last one and then we will we will start a new collector i mean a new event listener on this collect so now first of all we will do const command is equals to client dot commands dot get i dot values bracket zero so we are getting our command and now we will need few more things we are going to need the fields and now we will need to set up the embed fields i will tell you what the hell is this just give me a second we will do command dot options if you remember that we have options in our thing and by the way it is data dot options not options question mark dot map value is equals to return an object of something the name will be uh, value dot name of course what else it will be and the value will be v dot description so v dot name is the name of the option and value is v dot description that is the description of that option so we are getting the fields and our command name i mean and we are getting our temp command so on getting this event we have to update the interaction and we have to provide few simple things we just have to provide this to be honest the embed which have title command data name commands detail and then the description and then the fields and the components are now empty and that's all we have to do so now we have to do collector two dot stop so that's all we have to do guys and trust me this thing should work really good i mean it should work 
I, I mean at least I think it should work. So guys our client is up let's check out our code. Well guys let's start by using our help command and check out if this works or not. So you can see it works. It's a crazy bot help menu and stuff like that. Now if I choose a category like for example if I choose admin you will see that it loads and it is going to show us each and every damn command. And of course we can make this thing I mean this M capital and we can do lot more stuff and say hello don't have any description because it is a uh, you know message based command and then we can choose a damn command like purge and you can see uh, well you can uh, just give it some time bro like uh, what the hell interaction fail guys assignment to a constant variable of course it is a constant variable so we will just add a const here this means that we are creating a new variable and the thing will be fixed now and i'm really sorry for making such a stupid mistake but yeah and i'm really sorry for making such a stupid code but yeah I hope that it will help you so let me choose a category real quick choose slash help once more and by the way you will see that this choose comment thing will disappear in reason is not defined okay okay and by the way I'm so stupid we have to do reason right here all right you understand what I'm trying to say and of course I think we do need this collector thingy dot end thingy for our second collector as well what if someone never clicks it we are going to need it then right so we'll do collector 2 dot end and this time we are not going to do this thingy we will just remove it and bam that's all we have to do and let me just cls and run this function once more and let's run our help command once more and i'm really sorry for making such shitty code that it breaks this much even though i already made this command man but let's go to admin and let's choose a coolest command like probably xp where is it where is it there it is so let's do it and bam you can see it looks absolutely disgusting but you, you see it says xp detail and the manage xp for offer server and then it have all those options like enable disable and stuff like that so the thing is our command works and you can make cool modifications if you want just let me know if you have any suggestions and i will meet you later in another video and thanks a lot for watching and please let me know if you want me to make a video on a particular topic and sorry for being lazy and not uploading a video i will meet you later in another video till then bye